I think um, obviously football is a world game. It's it's played everywhere. You know, it's it's unique in that fact that most other sports we play here in Australia are only played maybe in two or three other countries around the world. With AFL, it's the only you know the only country it's played. So I think also Australia is a very multicultural country, and for all those people that have come here from all over the world, in their country, they play football, and uh, you know that. I think is is why so many people love love the game here. You know, a game that you can either play professionally or you can head down the park with your mates and have a kick around and just have as much fun, you know, doing that as well. And um, I remember in Brazil um, when we when we played the World Cup, the the atmosphere and and the way they watch football was was unbelievable. It was just like a you know, a huge party, you know. Um, they enjoy themselves so much. The, you know, they, they'll have a few drinks, they'll dance, they'll watch the game, and it's just it's it's a completely a different experience to obviously what it is here in Australia. I think it's I think in Australia we're sport for choice in sport. You know, we've got rugby league, we've got AFL, we've got cricket, we've got basketball, we got you can keep going, you can name 10, 15 sports, whatever it is, but then you, you go to Brazil, you go to England, and it's just football, you know, and that's the difference for me, I think. Um, for them, it's it's like life over there. It's, it's their livelihood. As soon as you are born into the world, your, your dad or your mum will give you a team, pretty much, and I think that's what we sort of got to get to in Australia, because it's, it's like that a little bit with the AFL, especially Melbourne, and a little bit with the, with the NRL as well, but because the A-League's so young at the moment, it, we probably don't have that, that culture uh, within it yet but you know when we see the supporters now have children and then their supporters and then they grow up supporting the same team that next generation I think is where we'll see the the growth so you know when the fans now come to a Sydney FC game and then they have a little kid that kid becomes a Sydney FC fan and then he'll grow up and his kid will be a Sydney FC fan and I think that's sort of the next generational thing will, will start to to kick in and um, it'll be a lot like it is overseas in, in the Brazils in the Englands in the Germanys and whatnot. Look, I just started playing it at a young age and um, as mentioned before, my, my parents just took me down to, to have a kick around and I just enjoyed it and I loved it. Um, it wasn't probably until I was you know, 15, 16 that I thought I could actually make a go of it and become a professional. Up until then it was just fun. I liked playing with my mates, used to play Saturday one team and Sunday another team and um, it wasn't, wasn't too serious, but then all, I guess when you get to a certain age is when you need to sort of make a choice. And I was lucky enough to have the choice to become a professional. And um, that's, I guess, when things get a little bit more serious. But um, to start with, it was just about enjoyment and, and, and mateship and, and having a bit of fun. Oh, I'd love it. I'd, I'd just love the sport to continue growing. You know, I think, as, as mentioned, we're still pretty young in terms of the league being only 12, 13 years old, whatever it is. You know, I'd love to see when we're 20, 30 years old that we're getting, you know, 20,000 at least to every game. Um, we've got maybe 16 teams in the comp. We've got a great pathway for youngsters to come through and, and give them a chance, um, as, uh, you know, instead of having to, to lose them to, a, to an overseas club or whatnot. So I think we're on the right path, but um, obviously still a lot of work to do. I'd like to see the league going from strength to strength. Um, financially, the club's you know, doing better. The FA Cup's a great thing. I think that's taken off, which is which is fantastic. You know, we see how popular the cup the cup games are in, in England and Germany and, and countries like this. So um, I think we're we're definitely heading in the right direction. But um, as mentioned, we still got a little bit of work to do.